15 Things You Didn't Know About Zoella Welcome to Alux.com, the place where future billionaires come to get inspired. Hello Aluxers and welcome to another exciting original video presented by Alux.com. Today we're revealing some interesting and surprising facts about YouTube personality, author, entrepreneur, and beauty vlogger Zoella. Zoe Elizabeth Sugg was born March 28, 1990 in Wiltshire, England, to a property developer father and beautician mother. She was very shy as a child and still experiences serious anxiety and occasional panic attacks. That anxiety kept her from going to college, and she instead started working as an apprentice at an interior design company. She started a blog where she wrote about fashion, beauty products, and random topics, and decided to start making videos at the request of her readers. She started vlogging in 2009 and her YouTube channel had 1,000 subscribers within a matter of months. Soon vlogging became her full-time job and her thousands of subscribers grew into millions. She now has posted hundreds of videos, published three books, launched her own range of beauty products and is one of the most sought-after influencers by advertisers. Her popularity and success show no signs of slowing down. If you're new here, welcome! Be sure to subscribe and follow us on Instagram at Alux. We're inspired by Zoella's ambition, passion, influence, and incredible success. So let's take a closer look at this internet sensation with the 15 things you didn't know about Zoella. Number 1. Her dad told her she needed to find a proper job instead of vlogging. When Zoella was let go from her interior design job, she put all of her focus into social media and her vlogging career. Her dad didn't understand the potential of Zoella's brand because he repeatedly told her she needed to get out of her bedroom and get a proper job. We're sure he's been very busy eating those words for the past several years. Number 2. She worked as an extra for a Harry Potter movie. Zoella was very excited to work as an extra on the 2001 film Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone when she was just 10 years old. She says her primary school was in the village they were filming in, so they asked her and some classmates if they wanted to be extras, and of course they said yes. IMDb lists her role as girl in potion class, but her scene was actually cut from the final version of the film. She also worked as an extra in the Chamber of Secrets, but was again cut out in the final film. Number 3. She gets paid up to $350,000 to make a video advertisement Zoella's incredible YouTube following means that she's in high demand for advertisers who want to reach her millions of fans, and they're willing to pay top dollar. She gets paid up to $350,000 per video advertisement that she makes. These videos are usually about 10 minutes long. She's made such videos for UK brands like Boohoo, Daniel Wellington, and Very. She's also had a deal with Unilever. Zoella says there is no amount of money that would tempt her to promote something she doesn't believe in, and she turns down 90% of the sponsorship deals she's offered. Number 4. She has lived in three Brighton residences in four years. In 2013, Zoe moved into an elegant seaside penthouse apartment in the prestigious Brighton area of East Sussex, England. In 2014, she moved from a glamorous apartment to a $1.3 million five-bedroom, five-bathroom house in the same Brighton area where she lived with her boyfriend, Alfie Dez. In 2017, due to privacy concerns, the couple moved to a third property in Brighton, another million-dollar home with five bedrooms. Number 5. Zoella was the first YouTube star to get a wax figure at Madame Tussauds. Well, technically, she's tied with her boyfriend Alfie, since the two wax figures were displayed together, but this was the first time a YouTube star was given a wax figure at one of the famed Madame Tussauds museums. Zoella thought it was a joke at first and didn't think she deserved to be made into a wax figure, but then the museum representative from Madame Tussauds in London told her that she and Alfie were the most requested celebrities next to One Direction of all the patrons the year prior, and she then saw it as an incredible honor. The completed display was unveiled in 2015. Number 6. She makes a minimum of $70,000 per month. Zoe's monthly income varies based on a number of factors, including book sales, YouTube views, product sales, sponsored posts, and other endorsements. But on average, she makes at least $70,000 per month, or $840,000 per year, although some months she does make more than that. Her yearly income has not been disclosed, but it's easily more than $1 million. Number 7. She broke the record for highest first-week sales for a first-time novelist. 
In 2014, Zoella's debut novel, Girl Online, sold 78,109 copies in the first week, breaking the record for first week sales for a first time novelist. She has since released two other novels in her Girl Online series, and all three have been bestsellers. She has sold over 3 million copies of her books combined, and has earned over $11 million in book sales alone. Her first non fiction book, Cordially Invited, is set to be released October 2018. Number 8. She received a Nissan Figaro as an anniversary present. In 2017, Alfie surprised Zoe for their fifth anniversary of dating with a pastel blue 1991 Nissan Figaro. The 27 year old car typically sells for between $6,000 and $12,000, but Alfie had the car updated with new carpet, new seats, a soft top, and automatic transmission. Zoe's been wanting one of these cars for years. She even tweeted in 2013, I really want a pastel colored Nissan Figaro. After he bought the car, Alfie responded to her four year old tweet saying, Don't worry, past Zoe, I got you. Number 9. Hers was the fourth UK YouTube channel to reach 10 million subscribers. Zoe's YouTube channel became only the fourth in the UK to reach the 10 million subscriber benchmark in February 2016. The other British channels that reached that mark before hers were One Direction, KSI, and Adele. Zoe now has over 12 million subscribers and well over 1 billion views. Number 10. She earns up to $165,000 per sponsored Instagram post. Zoella has many streams of revenue, and one of her most profitable is her sponsored posts. On Instagram, she gets paid up to $165,000 per sponsored post, which is quite a lot, but still far behind the top earning Instagram celebrity, Selena Gomez, who makes $550,000 per sponsored post. You can find some more interesting facts about the singer by clicking in the top right corner to watch our video, 15 Things You Didn't Know About Selena Gomez. Number 11. She didn't post any videos for two years after starting her channel. Zoe registered her YouTube channel called Zoella280390 in February 2007 at the age of 17. The numbers in the channel's name are for her birthday, by the way. However, she didn't post her first video until almost exactly two years later in February 2009. Number 12. She turned down the chance to meet Prince Harry. Zoe has serious problems with anxiety, and sometimes this keeps her from taking advantage of opportunities in her life, and one of those opportunities was meeting Prince Harry. He personally invited her to meet with him, but she was too scared to say yes. She hopes that he'll invite her again in the future, and that she'll be able to overcome her anxiety enough to meet him. Number 13. Her house has some serious security features. I mentioned earlier that Zoe had to move due to security concerns. Well, this mainly involved fans and random people coming up to her house day and night, ringing her doorbell, taking pictures, and generally invading her and Alfie's privacy. Therefore, in the new house, certain security measures were taken to minimize the invasion of privacy and threats from stalkers. This includes panic buttons hidden in every room throughout the house that, when pressed, will alert police in the area as well as police helicopters of a potential emergency situation at the house. If anyone rings the doorbell or approaches the gates, their faces are detected, scanned, and recorded. There is also an extensive camera system that monitors the entire estate. Zoe and Alfie feel much safer there than in their previous home. Number 14. Her most viewed video was a collaboration with Miranda Sings. Miranda Sings is a very popular YouTube personality that is played by Colleen Ballinger. Colleen is one of the most successful YouTube stars ever thanks to her quirky alter ego, Miranda Sings. Miranda's star power combined with Zoella's popularity led to Zoe's most successful collaboration in the 2014 video called Seven Second Challenge with Miranda Sings. In the video, the two girls take turns trying to achieve certain challenges like lick your toes, change your hair color, gargle mouthwash, and do a cartwheel all in seven seconds. The video currently has more than 22 million views. Number 15. Her net worth is $4 million. As of the beginning of 2017, Zoe's net worth is about $4 million. Of course, we'd expect that number to grow year after year as this entrepreneur and influencer continues to establish new revenue streams. Her boyfriend Alfie's net worth is estimated at around $2 million. Now that you've learned some more about Zoella, we'd like to know, if you started your own YouTube channel, what would it be about? Let us know in the comments.
Still here? Here's a bonus fact just for you. Zoe's very first video was called 60 Things in My Bedroom, and it consists of Zoe individually holding up 60 random things from her bedroom, with music in the background. This video formed part of the revenues that were included in her first check from YouTube, which came to a little over $80. It currently has 2.3 million views. Thank you for spending some time with us, Aluxers! Make sure to like and subscribe so you never miss another video. We also handpicked these videos, which we recommend you watch next. Thank you for being an Aluxer, and we'll see you back tomorrow.